Aston Martin claims the DBX is the true supercar of SUVs and based just on the looks, there is no doubt about it. But the competition in this category is heating up year after year. Lamborghini, Ferrari, Porsche are all aiming to offer the best blend of performance, comfort, design and dynamics. For now, Aston Martin balanced all these elements the best with the DBX 707 when it released it in 2022. And now the new refreshed model is even better. The new DBX 707 is now the only SUV in the lineup of Aston Martin. The base model is no longer offered. At this price tag of around $250,000, it's a really expensive SUV and removing the option of a less expensive model in place they know their clients will only choose the best available. Probably after the release of the 2020 DBX 707, the sales of the base DBX dropped. Now the changes in the new refreshed model aren't dramatic. While the exterior still looks the same with minor aesthetic enhancements, the biggest change is in the interior. Now the whole lineup uses the same interior design language except the DBS, which will be replaced soon and its replacement will definitely have the same design elements. The new cabin architecture is much more refined and luxurious with a perfect balance between touchscreens and tactility, but the focal point here is the infotainment system. Finally, after years of relying on outdated infotainment systems from Mercedes, Aston Martin developed their own now, and it was first introduced in the DB12. That was their first step in the transition to a new era of design. The new system has a 12.3-inch gauge cluster and a 10.25-inch infotainment display well integrated in the new dashboard with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And to complement the experience, there is a new audio system engineered for the volume and shape of the interior, developed by Bowers and Wilkins with their best technologies and innovations in the field. Now, in terms of power, there isn't any change. The 4-liter twin-turbocharged V8 engine can generate 707 PS and 900 Nm of torque with a 9-speed wet-clutch automatic gearbox. The acceleration from standstill to 60 miles per hour takes 3.1 seconds and the top speed is 193 miles per hour. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.